Okay, what are we looking at right now? This is one of two outfits coming out tonight, March 26th, part of the Nike Airphoria set, and this is Airphorian, the Lego counterpart for one of the outfits. Now, unfortunately, Epic Games did not give me the prices of the cosmetics I'm reviewing in this video, but this is the Lego counterpart for Eclipse. Epic Games, thank you for the early access. Airphorian comes in at an epic rarity and you do have three edit styles to choose from and here's a few back ones I like with the original style. We have the Balloon Llama, the Illusion Rune back bling, Max Stacks back bling for obvious reasons, Nosh had to do it, you already know why. Now this is also coming out tonight at an epic rarity, OG Max back bling, and then we have the Void Heart back bling. Coming in at an epic rarity, we have the Vac and Hack pickaxe here, give it a swing, see what it sounds like. Really good impact. Doesn't sound bad either. We also have an emote coming out called Fresh Out The Box. Give it a look-see here. Boy's getting down. Okay. All right. For the gameplay, I'm going to be using, obviously, Airforian with the original style, the brand new pickaxe vac and hack. For the glider, I'm going to try Wheel of Daggers, and the wrap is going to be Merktide. If I do recall, this character was in the creative experience that dropped last year for the first, I guess you can call it volume one, um, Nike Euphoria stuff here. No jiggle physics. I was expecting a little bit of jiggle physics. Not going to lie here. ADS should be okay. Nice and slim. No problems there. Harvesting tool appears to be pretty good. It appears to be pretty good so far. Wheel of daggers. I thought it'd be fun here because it almost looks like something that could be popped. And now we're going through a Wheel of Daggers, literally. Um, I thought it was kind of funny. Equip and equip of the new Harvesting Tool coming out tonight. Okay. Unique sound at night. Wow, look at the outfit is night too. Was not expecting that. Nice contrail. Great impact. There's a lot of different things coming off for the impact here. Impact is done very well. I will say that. I think I see some alien heads within the impact as well. Hitting opponents should sound good too. Let's see. Yeah, hitting opponents is fine as well. Now the new emote in game, which I believe it is called. Yep, fresh out the box. Which is also the back bling in case you haven't put that together yet. The little character dancing here. Kind of boring from your POV, not gonna lie. This is the second edit style for Airforian called Royal Volt. For some backbone combos, we have six string, beacon glass, max stacks for obvious reasons, OG max, part of the same set here, angular chick back bling, probably one of my favorites here, and then the Seattle Seahawks logo a go go. Love it or hate it, it looks good. For the gameplay, I am going to use the Pixel Pilot with the green edit style, and my weapon wrap is going to be Neon Venom. So there's not too much to go over here. We already did it with the original edit style, but this is the Pixel Pilot. I want to see kind of what it looks like in game and at night as well here. I do think this is my favorite edit style of the three I'm going to showcase. Just because I love doing like neon green stuff here, ADS is going to be fine. No problems there. And then at night, what does it look like? It doesn't look as exciting at night. I don't know why. It just looks so dull at night. Hmm. This is the final edit style called Laser Orange. I'm gonna start it off with Firestarter here. Now this is a stretch, but with this current edit style, I am resembling the Earth's core and using the Fractured World Backling to kind of resemble that, I guess. That was a stretch. Max stacks here again, OG Max. Now, Scarlet Edge goes great with that gradient to pink up in the head region. I think it looks really cool. And then, had to do it, Universal Bloom. Love that. For the glider, you might have known it's coming. The Mandala Disc. And then the weapon wrap is going to be Molten Angler Shift. So I believe I originally said the second edit style might be my favorite. I think I lied. This might be my new favorite edit style. Not only does it look good during the day, the animation within the outfit looks great here. But at night, it looks the best at night here. The other ones looked very dull and the only things that seemed to glow were those small accents within the outfit. On this one, 
everything glows and then the accents are kind of like a carbon fiber type of texture i think this is my favorite style here and this glider looks so good too especially as it turns orange near the feet and then you're standing on that yes final answer this is my favorite edit style before we cover eclipse let's go over the back bling og max some outfits with og max here we have airy from the volume one collab with nike grind here looks great makes a lot of sense iconic as well not bad maxed out max with og max on really fun that's what i'm gonna use for the gameplay as well we have shadow ops let me talk to your manager with the additional edit style and lastly the champion stashed outfit so the physics are fun here with og max i was curious about what it looks like at night first of all looks pretty cool with that glow now it is hard to see the grin during the day here because of how bright it is now i'm also curious about doing the emote with the back bling equipped fresh out the box because it is og max that comes out of the shoe box and I thought maybe it would have disappeared from your back. Doesn't seem to be the case, but now we know. Okay, now we know, I guess, but the physics are fun here. This is the original edit style for Eclipse. And if you're noticing the animations within the head portion of the outfit, those are the same type of uh, graphics we had within the impact of the harvesting tool we already covered earlier in this video. It's all tying together now. I'm gonna wear universal bloom right here. I think it looks pretty good with the skin tone. Blade bag with that pink almost looks too perfect because of the hair color as well. Max stacks for obvious reasons. OG Max. The Enchanted Feather Fighters, probably one of my favorites here. And then lastly, the Shine Pack. For the gameplay, we are using the Queen's Cloud Carriage and the Weapon Wrap because of all of the animations coming off of her head that kind of reminds me of Emoticons in Fortnite, the Emonical Wrap. So the hair physics are great right here. I can imagine that you probably won't have the same physics with the back bling equipped, but we will test that very shortly here. Should look decent at night as well here. What does it look like at night? Looks okay. It's not too bad. I'm okay with that. Collider should look okay as well here. The Queen's Cloud Carriage. And then obviously the harvesting tool definitely made for her here so what's it look like with her everything should make sense now in terms of the impacts we'll go to nighttime here a little more visible now that everything's kind of making sense here and coming full circle i might as well do the emote as well see if anything changes i don't think it will I do like the little high steps there, left and right. I do like that. So one more time, the hair physics, look at it now. And yep, we still have the physics on the front portion of the hair, but obviously not the back anymore. If you're still... <laughs> I can't say it. If... <laughs> okay, okay. If you're still here... <laughs> I can't say it. Still here. If you're still here with me, give me your favorite topping on a pizza in the comment section. This is the night edit style for Eclipse. Not gonna lie. Don't like it. Not a fan of it at all. We're gonna use King's Bling here to start it off. The Cube Ether looks clean as well. Adam Even Bloom, kind of expected here. OG Max had to show you. Enchanted Feather Fighters once again, and lastly, the Glass Wings. I wanted this style, you big dummy. That's what I wanted. For the gameplay, the J Balvin board, and the weapon wrap is the Cat Stronaut. Okay, I'm pretty sure I just used this weapon wrap in the same glider for that disco skin that came out not too long ago. <laughs> I just realized that in the loading screen. Um, literally, this is why videos take me so long. <laughs> because I can't talk. I mispronounce things all the time. It's a struggle recently. It's been a real struggle. I just can't speak. I have no idea what I'm talking about. I'm a big old idiot. But at night here, what do we have? Definitely have some glow. Harvesty tool still looks good here because obviously made for her. And ADS is fine as we expected. 
Epic Games, thank you again for the early access. That is supporter creator P-I-Z-0 in the Atom Shop. The rumor is they're coming out tonight. That's what they told me. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you on the live stream. See ya.